someday I will learn to record videos when it's daylight outside. But today is not that day. So. <laughs> Happy 2015, everybody. I cannot believe we're 2015 already. So exciting. So, um, just to kick things off, I figured I would do a January TBR because that's what we do. Right? Right. Okay, so the first book that I want to mention, because I'm already currently reading it and I'm almost... Uh, according to my Kindle, I'm about 50% done with it, and that's War of the Worlds by H.G. Wells. I'm really enjoying it. I, I really like the narrator for the audiobook that I have, too, because I've been listening to it mostly at work. Uh, and, yeah, I really, really enjoy the, the narrator. I'm afraid I don't remember what his name is, but uh, he's very good, and um, yeah, basically, if you read anything with the English accent or an accent of just about any kind, I will read and enjoy. I realize that I should not go to London at all, probably, because that's where all the aliens always go. If you watch Doctor Who <laughs> and, you know, in War of the Worlds, the aliens are invading London, so don't go to London, guys. Just kidding, though. I really want to go to London someday. So second, the second book I want to read is this big puppy um the name of the wind by patrick rothfuss i always want to say rotherfuss and i don't know why i want to say that but anyway, patrick rothfuss um i've heard great things only great things about it um susie at read susie read loves it and i know there's at least one other booktuber who just really loves this book and this series and i just i'm i'm excited uh one of the Goodreads groups that I sometimes peek in on <laughs> is reading it this month. So, and if I decide I don't want to read this, I could always just reread Anne of Green Gables because I have not read that book in ages. But for now, we're going with Name of the Wind. So, we're going to do that. And then I need to finish Harry Potter and the Goblet of Fire. I didn't really read much more after... Like the 26th just because things got so crazy I don't know um, yeah so I want to finish and then of course continue on to the order of the Phoenix we got we got to do that and then um, I need to read four uh, which is a collection of short stories novellas whatever you want to call them by Veronica Roth for the Divergent series because I did finally finish <laughs> the series in November yeah, I finished Allegiant in November, finally, oh my gosh, and so, <laughs> I love four so much, <laughs> and so I'm, I'm looking forward to just getting lots of stories from his point of view, because I love, I love him very much, and lastly, um, I do want to try and get to, oh, you can't really see, oh, there it is, Falling Kingdoms. Uh, by Morgan Rhodes, and uh, the only reason why I picked up this book now is because Lainey at Ginger Ray's Lainey kind of crazy fangirled about it in one of her more recent-ish videos, and how could I resist? <laughs> so also, I like, I just really like this cover. I know it's kind of like, maybe I shouldn't, there are knives and weapons, but... <laughs> But I, I I like this cover. I think it looks cool. I like the font that the title is on, and I just, I really like it. I almost forgot. How could I almost forget? I don't have the book yet because it doesn't come out until the 27th. But I know that when it comes out, I'm going to, like, semi-devour it. Devour it. I have a hard time saying devour. And it is Fairest by Marissa Meyer. <laughs> I need it. I really wish that I could get it sooner, but it's okay. I will wait. I'm very excited for it, though. I'm very excited. I just finished Cress last night. My first book of 2015. Is I finished it yesterday, and and so I know that it will. <laughs> Ferris will hold me until winter, which is coming out in November, I think. Right? I don't know, but I'm really. I'm just so. 
oh gee, that's, that's still a lot of books. I don't know, you know, like, I don't know how far I will get, how much farther I'll get in Harry Potter. Um, but I know I'll finish War of the Worlds for sure. I don't know how far I'll get in The Name of the Wind, but I will start it. <laughs> if I don't finish four, that's kind of sad. I should be able to finish four at least. So that's two books. And then, um, you know, if I'm not, I'm not, if I'm not feeling Harry and I'm not feeling Name of the Wind, I will read Fallen Kingdoms. And then when Ferris comes out, I will read that. So we are pretty set this way. Yes. Um, and non-fiction book reading, um, when we're talking, where is it? Where are you, baby? When we're talking Bible-wise, because I am determined to, why am I holding it back? That's terrible. <laughs> when I'm, I am determined to read my Bible more often as well, and I have started a chronological, um, read the Bible in a year series, um, where it's going to take you through chronologically, which I'm I'm hoping and thinking that that will go better for me because I've tried doing it just like book to book to book and I, I <laughs> I've never made it. I think the farthest that I've made it that way is Ecclesiastes. Yeah, so hmm. I mean that works with the New Testament, but not Old Testament for me. So anyways, I think it'll just work better that way. So that's my Bible reading goal. But, um, yeah. So, now that all those reading goals are out in the open, let's hope that I can actually do that. <laughs> Anyways, that is all for now. Thank you for watching. And again, happy 2015, everybody. I'm, I'm feeling really excited about this year. And that's going to be for another video. <laughs> Anyways, um... Have a good rest of your day or night or evening or afternoon or whatever. And I will talk to you soon. Bye. How many awkward faces can we make before we start recording?